<laughs> all right, so we got everybody's current, almost or current, one of your favorite Pokemon trainers up on stream, and I'm very okay. excited to be commentating his match with you. Yeah. So we got Puppet here with 10, the Greninja. So we got a Pokemon battle, and we better be going to Pokemon Stadium. Yeah. Oh, of course, of course. And that's what I want to see real quick. And we Where got a water battle. Doing? That's true, that's true. All right, so Puppe has been on fire recently. Obviously, we've been yeah. seeing him at CEO. We've been seeing him at his locals and just tournaments going first and other other events as well. But 10, opening up strong. Honestly, the Pokemon trainers in general have been doing very, very strongly recently. They have been. I mean, I know personally, my brother Jay is a Pokemon trainer, mm -hmm. and they're all friends. All of them are in a group right. chat. They're all helping each other out, Aww. being like, yeah, well, yeah, I just sort of got nerfed, but let me tell you what, what Charizard got, you know? Aww. Aww. So they're, they're all helping each other out. They're all super supportive of each other, and I know that the Pokemon trainers are having puppies back, but 10! But 10 is like, nah! Stop talking about Pokemon Trainer guys. Yeah, it's talk about me. Tell, Look tell how me. good I'm doing. Let me tell you about Greninja. Greninja, a character that is very underrated. He's kind of sneaking up on everybody. Yeah. I think he's a very high tier character. He, Because of the, the fact that hit stuns are so big in this game and that you can only air dodge once, that gives a huge advantage to Greninja. Yeah. In Smash 4, you're able just to air dodge. Now you can't do that. You take a lot of hits real quick. His setups are fast. His setups are strong and his kill potential is out of this world. Definitely, so. like even even the combo game is very strong. Like he's got drag downs, he's got just like normal combos where he can just get you above him. He's got like decent projectiles. Pretty strong character. Yeah, exactly. But Puppy they're gonna bring it back and make it uh, a little bit hard for 10 here to keep up this momentum. Right. But the damage is still going and oh. as we're saying that 10 is gonna take up the second stock. What is going on? He's up a whole stock on Puppy. As the Pokemon theme song starts playing. <laughs> this is the most <laughs> docile like music. <laughs> <laughs> like just a normal day, Poke Ninja. <laughs> yeah, most Ten just playing absolutely out of his mind right now. I think that's something that Greninja does so well against Pokemon trainers, being in your face. Right. And I think that's where Pokemon Trainer does struggle with, especially someone like Ivysaur, who really spaces you out right. and forces you to really commit to options. And that's just not what's happening here. But are we going to get the Vine Whip? We're not going to. Ten is going to get a huge opening. For sure, for sure. But still a lot of good percent. Your, oh, okay. Can't air dodge that close to Ivysaur's down air. Yeah, you just oh, gotta get goodness. out of that situation. But uh, luckily, though, Ten still in the lead. But Puppe can adapt and come back yeah. quickly. We know the potential this character has in definitely. terms of killing. Definitely, definitely. Here comes the Charizard, the back air. Oh, man. <laughs> I thought we were seeing Sam Sora, but that down tilt to up smash is going to kill it a very Man. early percent. Ten's going to take game one. Oh my goodness. This was wild. Uh, yeah, that, that, that was kind of wild. It was a wild battle. It was the Pokemon Championships, man. These Pokemon have been training for a very long time <laughs> to get where they are. And I think that right now, Ten's level is just a little bit higher than the Charizard it's, scored on Ivysaur. This Greninja looking pretty solid. Oh, I yeah. really love the way he went out there all the way and got he that He really air. did. He saw that air dodge coming in from Pape and was like, you know what, you got lag. I'm going to go take advantage of that. And here comes the air dodge. That down air so good. Yeah, so much time after the air dodge to do some down air like that. Yes. Tried oh. to get him with the back air on Charizard. <laughs> and it would have worked, too. <laughs> It was just a little bit this timed off, right. but uh, let's see if he can pull himself here. I like the stage counter pick. Going on a platform stage makes it a bit harder for Greninja to actually get follow ups. Right. Of course, he can reset on platforms and get even more damage than he normally would, but mm -hmm. I feel like that's most characters anyway. So. For sure, for sure. But uh, Pokemon Trainer on a platform stage, especially as Ivysaur can use his up airs just as we're seeing, and really extend his Vine Whip and get these setups to make it so hard for you to actually land, and is just doing a, such a good job at making this damage at the moment. Yeah, it is post-patch Ivysaur that we're playing here. Yes. So just like the hitboxes of down air and, and up B are a little bit different now. So. Yep, they are just a little bit touch different. We got 10 at the moment, showing that that Ooh. really matters. But Puppy proven himself that, you know, the Ivysaur down air is still pretty still strong. Still pretty good. Pretty good. Still pretty good. Yep, as well as that back throw going to take out the first stock. And now we got ourselves an edge guard here. Let's see what 10's got. He's been so clean with those edge guards. Definitely, definitely. Even like the, the ledge play has been very solid. Yeah. Almost gets it with the Vine Whip. Didn't read him that he was going to go to the right instead of the left after that up air. All right, a few misses from both of them. That uh, that up special in pre-patch would have sent him a little bit farther than that, but right. a little bit less hits and knockback at that tenth. But here we go. We got 10 here having a really hard time. It's like an entire new Puppe. This stage really coming into play for him. Yeah, I think just the combos that Puppe is getting off of these platforms are really, really solid, right? Yes. Like he's being able to just like follow him with the up airs or even while he's above him doing the down here to land, so. 
great Rock stuff, though, open. from 10 using the fair, knowing that Pape has been jumping just a little bit too much, taking right. advantage of that. Now, here comes the combo from Greninja. We know how much he can make. I'll try to set it up with the up tilt. Doesn't do it just yet. Again, these platforms, so good yeah, for really, Ivysaur. Really, really solid. And a stock lead right now for Pape. Yeah, this is uh, the same game as last, but reversed, you right, know? Right. I like the little mix up there after going for back air, going and getting a sh uh, grab instead. Good yeah. combos. A little bit of a mix up right there. I see the. S the, the okay. I was going to say oh. that the shield was low, but that parry made it look like nothing. Was able to actually escape the back airs from Ivysaur and now has himself another edge guard. Let's see what Water can do to Grass, though. Not too much, it's looking like. Yeah. Look at all these back. Okay, goes right into the Vine Whip. Almost gets the up air, just a little bit off of the spacing, but we'll get the down throw into the Vine Whip. Won't follow it up, but we'll land with the up air. Yeah, gets the air dodge out after that up B, but the up air is ready for that. Really good Pokemon switch there. Yeah, so it's so important to know, okay, I'm going to take this hit. I got to use these frame one switches yeah. to go ahead and save myself. That fourth throw buff would have probably taken it out at the edge, just a little bit off, trying to get the down air needed. Almost the fourth tilt, but that... Claw. Yeah, the slash. The slash. Let me cut your nails real quick, Chuck. Because, <laughs> <laughs> let me tell you, they're pretty yeah. big. They are pretty big. Yeah, Pepe going to take game two. I loved his decision of going to Battlefield. Yeah. Such a good stage for Pokemon Trainer. Again, using the up airs to juggle and just catch landings. It really makes you feel like it's a flat stage. It's, you can't escape anyway. It is, it is pretty scary. Greninja does get like a decent amount of combos as well, but Pepe was just able to use it way more to his advantage. Exactly. All right, but let's see. This is the counter pick here from 10. So this yeah. is going to be important how he plays on it. But also while um, Puppet can also adapt. I love the stage decision. Short edges, so kills off the side. Yeah. But long blast zones on the top. So it's going to be a little bit hard for up airs from uh, Ivy. So we're going to go ahead and kill you. you yeah, know? he got a lot of KO confirms off the, uh, the up airs for sure. And yes. even Vine Whip also going to be a little bit weakened right now. Beautiful parry coming in from 10 here. I like that. A lot of people you know, try to counter Ivysaur's back airs and his fares, which can be sometimes lagless depending on spacing. And oh, oh <laughs> my god. What nerf? Vine, Vine Whip's still out here. <laughs> yeah, I mean, again, if you're choosing these stages with the short edges, you have to keep in mind you're also buffing your opponent, and that right. Vine Whip was definitely going to get one of those buffs on this stage. For sure. Oh my god, almost punched the air dodge too. Puppe really running away with this right now. Yep, here we go. And I don't know how... Um, 10 is going to be maybe coming back. Greninja is a character that really does a great job while in advantage, but disadvantage, it's very, very hard for him. Yeah. Not to say that it is impossible. He's showing such great work with this character. Yeah, really unfortunate that he couldn't get the up air there. That would have been a nice little KO. Still not high enough percent. Yeah, uh, sadly, this stage, the longest blast zone in Smash. So it's, uh, it's so hard. And again, I, I feel like this stage is really working against 10 at the moment. Yeah. Especially on a character like Charizard, too. Yeah, you're going to live, honey. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, here we go. We got ourselves a beautiful recovery from 10 to mix that up, and that upper is finally going to take him out. Nice. He's got some work to do. Definitely, definitely. 108% possible, okay. especially when he gets him off stage like this. Yeah, it, it's a start. Uh, start. Definitely. I mean, you got to be careful, though. Charizard. Especially off the side, he's known to be killing, but here comes the up airs. Could start something new. Oh, almost following him on the right platform there. Got him in shield. Below him is a really good spot for this Greninja right now. Always. You never want to be over Greninja, and I feel like Puppe's just doing such oh, well done! Ah! T! I mean, 10. Every <laughs> 10. 10. <laughs> 10. I was like, T. I thought you meant, I really thought you meant T as in drama. I was like, that's T. That's T. <laughs> <laughs> But oh, there dang. we go, Squirtle over here coming out to get this damage racked up as soon as possible because 10, even though has been down, has not been out, and he's been showing that. But oh. Ivysaur are going to come in and extend this lead over here. Yeah, these Ivysaur combos, he's getting so much mileage off of these back airs in particular. He really is. Just like, he, he spaces them well so they're not terribly unsafe, and then when he does get a hit, he can get like another back air, if not more. Yeah. All right, almost. Ooh, I know he wanted the down tilt, but ended up going for the down smash instead. Definitely happens. A back air. Whoa, he's going way out there. He's alive. No, he's oh. not. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. The confirms into up air. So good. Solid. Vine whip, razor leaf. Razor leaf, yeah. Up, even though the razor leaf is also slower in the new patch, it's so good. I really so just good. setting up. Look at this. Here we go. We got, we got some, some follow-ups over here.